Canvas dashboard. When you log into Canvas, this is your landing page. It always brings you here first each time you log in. And the first thing you will see is your published courses. And notice it keeps account of how many you courses that you have published. Now, just a special note, your published courses could be courses that you are a student in or even a teacher of. So just keep that in mind as well. If you scroll down just a tad bit, you'll notice you have your unpublished courses. That means these are courses that no one can see but you unless you've added someone into the course and they will have access to see it under their unpublished courses as well. These are courses that I will use for my sandbox where I'm learning and playing and exploring Canvas. And also as teachers, you may see under your unpublished courses that you have courses based off the information that you had in JCampus and Clever with your students there because we do have it synced where Clever will sync in your information and preload pre your students and your courses for you. And we'll get into that in another video. Also to the right, it helps me guide my day. I have a to-do list. So when I get here to the dashboard, it helps me get a mindset of what I have to knock off my list for today. So these are my assignments that I need to do. So it gives me some priority on my assignments. So as I get these done, I can mark them off my list, which I love for students. Also, if I scroll down just a tad bit more, this is where I also come to create a new course. I will start a new course here in Canvas from the dashboard and students can also view their grades from the dashboard. Also, you have three dots here. You know, that means more options. If I click on the three dots, I can actually change my dashboard view. Card view is the ultimate favorite for me, but everyone has their different opinions and some things may work better for others. So I definitely want you to explore and decide which view you would like. So we're already looking at the card view. Let's look at the list view. This is what the list view looks like. And what it does is show your to-do history. For me and how I operate, it wouldn't work for me. So definitely check it out and see if it's something that will work out for you for your dashboard view. And the last view for your dashboard is the recent activity. This may work for someone as well. It will show your recent activity when you first log into your Canvas dashboard. So I'll see any messages, announcements, assignments, or discussions that I need to respond to or check, take a look at. So that's an option. This is my second favorite. My favorite is card view. All right, one other feature here on the three dots is the color overlay. So you can add a color over, overlay to your cards if you would like here on your dashboard. That's another personal option. I'm gonna turn mine off. Also, in an upcoming series video, we'll talk about the course cards because here on your dashboard, each course has a course card and you'll be able to personalize those. And that'll be a whole separate video. But that is your Canvas dashboard in a nutshell.